Shalom, I'd like to start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, double honors to the apostles, and the elders of Great Millstone, salutations to the elect brothers scattered abroad. My name is Zamwan Gabar, back with another quick lesson, Lobo, to edify and feed the lambs of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai through the Holy Spirit, Rekha Kodash. And I'm watching this video, well, I started watching this video, and, you know, I just, I noticed something that really, you know, kind of, you know, pissed me off, you know. Not to sound emotional or anything, but, you know, I'm going to play the video. That right there, man. All right. First of all, man, the scriptures tell you in Romans, you know, can can two walk together at least they be agreed? All right. Now this guy Sadnetta or Sadnega, you know, over here, calling on the name Yahweh by Shimi Shai, you know, saying Yahweh by Shimi Shai Brakata, basically, you know, saying a salute, which Yahweh by Shimi Shai means the Most High. In the name of his son, bless you. Alright? Now, what he did right there is in violation of the commandments of the Most High. Alright? This is um the book of Exodus, chapter 20, verse 7. It says, Thou shalt not take the name of the Lord, thy power, in vain. For the Lord will not hold him guiltless, that taketh his name in vain. Now the Lord, I, the Lord is Yahweh. When you read Lord in all caps, it's Yahweh. All right? And his son is Yahweh Shai. Now what Sa'aneta did was take the name of the Lord Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai in vain. But the scriptures say, for the Lord will not hold him guiltless that taketh his name in vain. Because Sa'aneta doesn't mean that. He doesn't mean that. He doesn't mean the Most High, Yahweh, in, in the name of his son, Yahweh Shai, bless you. So he took that in vain. Now, when you look up the word vain in, in the regular dictionary online, you could Google it. You know, it says, um... Vain, having or showing an excessively high opinion of one appearance's abilities or worth. Let's skip to the second one. Producing no results. Useless. Okay? Useless. Producing no results. Now, that's what vain is. All right? Because, you know, you use the name Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai like that, and you don't mean it. You're, pro you're producing no results. You know, it's useless. You're using the name of the Lord in vain. You don't mean it. So you're not supposed to call upon the name of the Lord unless you mean it. You know? It's pointless. It's hopeless. It's in vain. So the scriptures say not to take the Lord name in vain. Thou shalt not take the name of the Lord thy power in vain. For the Lord will not hold him guiltless that taketh his name in vain. And this is the same guy that came up to 34th and 7th. You know? As like a snake. You know, talking with the apostles, you know, and then trying to, trying to, you know, fail the attempt, trying to make, make the scriptures seem like it's some fairy tale book, you know, bringing up doctrines that are in the scriptures and try to make it seem like we're, you know, we're, we're criminals or whatever the case is, man. This is the same guy that does not even believe in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. All right, this is the same guy who does not believe he's an Israelite, man. You know, this is the same guy that come up against the, the true men of the Lord. But he's calling upon the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. And, you know, he's in this so-called black unconsciousness group movement. The Most High is going to deal with him, man. All right. And and, and scriptures say, let me get that, man. I, I quoted earlier. In Romans, Romans, the third chapter. Let 
No, I'm sorry. I believe it was an emo. Let me see. Um, what did I quote earlier? Slakia. Slakia. What did I quote? Um. Oh yeah. Amos 3, I said Romans 3, slack here. It says, this is Amos chapter 3, verse 3. It says, can two walk together except they be agreed? And the answer is no, two cannot walk together except they be agreed. All right, now there's no agreement amongst the Israelites and the black community. All right, there's no agreement. Slack, you had to pause that real quick to do something. But, um... Yeah, the scriptures say, can two walk together except they be agreed? And the answer is no. All right? And here you have this guy calling upon the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. All right? With this whole video, you know, with this whole awards business, the Lord ain't dealing with that, man. There ain't, there ain't no prophets ever gave our award for being the best speaker or best reader or whatever. All right? The Most High ain't dealing with that. And it's plain as day to see who the Most High is truly dealing with. All right? So, that's another... That's another video, which I'm sure brothers already getting all on top of that. But um, last scripture I'm gonna close out with is um, the Book of Proverbs, chapter 11, verse 21. It says, "Though hand join in hand, the wicked shall not be unpunished, but the seed of evildoers, the seed of righteous shall be delivered." Excuse me. Though hand join in hand, the wicked shall not be unpunished, but the seed of righteous shall be delivered. All right, so though hand joining in hand, you know, you got these, you know, we use a scripture against Esau, definitely, you know, but though you got, you know, these Israelites, you know, all fellowship with the so-called black community, black conscious group, who don't believe in Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, who were there crucifying Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, saying, let, let his blood be upon us. Scripture said, oh, they join in hand, the wicked is not going to be unpunished. All right, but the seed of the righteous shall be delivered. Now, who are the righteous? The elect. Okay. So, again, this guy right here, blaspheming. You know. And you all shall say, it's like a, to say, using the name of the Lord in vain. All right? Because he truly don't believe in Yahweh Shai. So, I'm going to play that again. joining hand you know hey that's why great millstone starting with the apostles on down we don't got time for this man this unity thing you know most high ain't dealing with unity most high can't divide how shy is coming to divide scriptures tell you that man you know but anyway with that i'm gonna end it and say shalom to the elect